Ready to do some real work? I got some customers who are dying to get out of paradise. You're going to help them do that. I've left you a truck. Use it to drive my customers to the docks, where our ship will be waiting. The docks are guarded, so you're going to work a little harder to get past them without a fight. That's where Rafael Merrero comes in. He's a forger and a very important client of mine. His papers will get you through. Do this for me, and Paolo's debt is wiped clean. Everyone wins. When the boat leaves, the boat leaves. spoke to our mutual friend, Bembe. What did that snake have to say? He says I do this one last dirty job for him. You walk away clean. I'm not proud. But I do it again to get Talia and me out of Yara. Danny, I know the risk you are taking for me. I won't forget this. Thank me if I get through this in one piece. Danny! Danny, Danny, Danny! <sighs> what do you want, Bicho? Nothing. No, that's wrong. It's definitely
Dinga. Military's got them. Bembe. Why is it everywhere you send me I find trouble? Speculation is a waste of time. And time is money. Take matters into your own hands, Rojas. And fast. Rafael is there somewhere. I shouldn't have gone out today. Muchas gracias. Vamos. Take care of those soldados. Then we can talk business. No way to treat an artista. Oye, over here. Gracias. 
Did Bembe send you? Si. You, Rafael? I got papers for you. They're in the truck nearby with Bembe's costumers. You better hurry. What about you? I'm going back to my studio. I have more art to create. Bembe, I got your clients and your papers from Rafael. Okay, Ross. Now, make sure my precious cargo gets to the port. Si. Okay. Everyone good back there? <laughs> Vámonos! Yeah, I'm in the truck. Boss waiting. Try not to damage the goods. Goods? I got a truck full of people here. No, Danny. That's a truck full of money. My money. Papers. Wait a minute, Christmas trees? Do we even grow those here? Mexicans pay crazy money for this. How you think El Presidente found in Maria's new face? Okay, go through. Bembe better be here. Beautiful work, Rojas. I'm sure our friends here will be very appreciative. Ah, moment, amigos. This isn't your stop. Que coño, they're not going? Business expense. What the fuck does that mean? My talent is commerce, Rojas. Why don't you leave that part to me and you can focus on your talents? Run back and tell Paolo he has my permission to leave. Vaya con Dios. Good news. Bembe's off your back. That was one hell of a debt you owed. Gracias, Danny. We keep this between us. Talia hates everything Bembe represents. I owe you one. But Talia and I are still getting off this island. Juan?
You here to pick up Paolo Slack? We got a lot to do here. Vamos. Juan? Who is this? It's Danny, Juan. Who? Danny. Danny! Do you need something? You called me. Not possible in my current state. But I'm glad you reached out. Meet me on Libertad Island immediately. Okay, why? One! <sighs> shit. Oh shit, look who it is! Finally! I want the same with my boyfriend. Who told you? How do we know Libertad is really on our side? It's a gamble. But My best custom.
Top of the line supplies for you. Oye, guerrilla, I bet you a deep. About time. Need you to do some dead drops for the cause. You drop off the vivido, I pick up the profits. Who are the drops for? You try these? I took one for research, now I can't stop. Turn my piss purple. You want one? No. Who's paying us for the vivido, Juan? Before we slit Castillo's throat, we should ask for more flavors. It's the Yankees. Worse. CIA. The fucking CIA is in bed with Libertad? What's Clara think of this? Well, if she knew, I would hope it'd be something like, Thanks, Juan. I'm so happy to have guns to kill fascists named Castillo. Etc., etc. Freedom costs money. Clara doesn't ask. And I'll never tell. It's a private club. Just you, me, and lighthouses filled with Anton's candy. Clara needs to stay shiny. For the people. You're protecting her. I'm not so sure I'm the only one looking out for Clara. Just remember... After La Revolución, she won't have time for a guerrilla like you. Just in case. That's the spirit, guerrilla. I say yes, I feel like you are still going to tell me. Fucking drug lords want to stash their cash in American real estate so they can launder it. Fifty million dollar deal, Danny. That's great, Juan. I even got them to throw in a few kilos of product. Sold it on the black market, but lost it all at the tables in Monte Carlo. How is this helping me right now?
one down. First package dropped off. Okay, good. Hey, did I tell you about the time I broke the deal for Gorbachev? Let me guess. You made the deal. Took a cut for yourself. Lost it in a dumb bet you can't even remember. I mean... Yes? I think this means we are family now. I had hope for Clara, but I got you. You thought I would have noticed Libertad selling my Viviro to the Yankees? You're a dead man! When the Garillas arrested my family in 67, me, Papa, was dragged to this very cell. I was put in the cell next door. Thirteen. Like you, mijo. We used to talk every single night through this vent. I loved it. His voice taught me to be strong, to be a man. And then the Garillas came. Every day I'm in charge. Oh. <coughs> yeah. Crime by crime, piece by piece, he paid to the Garillas. But we would still talk every single night. <laughs> Until they took his tongue for his lies to Yara. Stop! Papa, stop this! Who is this girl here to you? Ah. I think we should skip a few steps, Raoul. Mm. 
Viva Libertad. The attack. The Hotel Paraíso. Danny was there. You... You told me that you hid in the tunnel. Danny could have killed me. Could have given me to Libertad. We have no time for lies. I've stopped running. I've listened. I've learned. I've done everything you have asked. I will be El Presidente. Let Danny go. I am not a monster, Diego. We will give them a chance. Diego, not fucking right. Castillo's a fucking psychopath. We're burned. Castillo was waiting. He and his fucking general tried to... Juan, 
We're burned. Castillo was waiting. He and his fucking general tried to kill me. Glad you made it. I, uh... I have to ask. Did you talk, Danny? Not a fucking word. Once a guerrilla, always a guerrilla. The kid, Diego, he saved my life. What? Shot Anton's general dead. Old dog? Bingo. This is good. This is very good. We are playing 4D chess in space now, Danny. Fuck your 4D chess one. I just got my molars ripped out. Same thing happened to me back in the Congo. Except I did it to myself. Just chew in the front, like a rabbit. And Juan, let's leave Clara out of it. We got burned. That's all she needs to know. Clara's not enough to fucking deal with, let alone you almost getting torn to pieces. Gracias. That croc looks mean as hell. You're from Esperanza, I can tell. Hola. Hey. Any croc lovers here? What's up? Go something you will be interested in. I've heard a lot of shit about you, Roas. Mostly good. I am never coming back here. To think I looked up to these ancianos. Don't waste your time. We're freeing El Este with or without them. You need to talk to my boss, Yelena. And you need to see our operation up close. Swing by El Agujero. It's La Moral's badass headquarters in Concepcion. Say this password to our doorman. Muerto el perro, se acabó la rabia. I'll tell Yelena you're on your way. Honron, I'm at a church in... Where am I? The Savannah. Basilica de la Virgen. That building should be celebrating his birthday. He's a hundred years old. I'm not seeing a party here. Castillo stole the renovations. A couple of corrupt priests and well, it's shut down. Oh, shit. I was baptized there. A lot of creepy, junky priests came through that place. 
Come mierdas. Can I do? You should talk to Senora Toga and see what she needs. She's the president of the farmers' collective there. I'm on it. She just told her that the her farmers are about to break our agreement. We really need these people on our side, Danny. Getting close, I think. Jelena's the big boss. I'm team captain. And you won't be able to miss Gilberto. Why? Who's Gilberto? Only the most fabulous spy on me. You can't even fart in El Este without Gilberto's network hearing about it. Spies and hackers. La moral sounds like the real deal. We don't fuck around. And if you've never been to Concepcion before, the place has got a curfew. When the sun goes down, soldados come out. Thanks for the heads up. Coño, I got a helicopter on my ass. Call me when you get there. On run. I'm at Concepcion. How do I find La Moral? I'll send you a peek. Show no one. What are you sending me? It will help you find the door. Don't forget the password and remember. my support. Muerto el perro, se acabó la rabia. Welcome to El Agujero. Try anything and I'll cut your head off and use it as a football. Nice to meet you too. My name's Danny. Alfredo. Down the stairs. I 
hope Sergio is okay. A week ago feels like a month ago. I'd be dying to swap out people at the cafe. I hate it when people don't want it. I need six volunteers. I'll talk to my people, honey. Big Jorge and Anna's gangs are probably on the ship. You're Yelena? Mierda. Danny, right? Where's my medicine? You mean Libertas meds? I gave them to the legends. No. You handed it to some retirees shitting their diapers on top of a mountain. What could you possibly want from them? We need more than bullets and guerrillas to take down Castillo. Like it or not, Yaranos love the legends. Clara Garcia loves her politics. Good luck getting those abuelos off their asses. We could use La Moral's help. You know why Clara never told you about us? Because to her, we're just a bunch of kids playing with guns. She loves to talk about the future. But it's her future, not ours. Clara's just a Castillo who lost his dick. So you have a better plan for Yara? Bullets first, politics later. You said you needed volunteers. Admiral Benitez got the jump on us a couple of hours ago. She's holding my people hostage on a cargo ship. I'll go. Alone? I don't get it. Consider us even for the meds. Save my people, then I'll think about it. Mm -hmm. For real? Libertad? No shit. You saving our people, right? That's the plan. I know a farmer with a helicopter who can fly you out to the ship. Follow me. Take all the rasol. Be nice to him. Ando. Don't worry. I'm a friend. Go <laughs> now. You're with Libertad? I am. I think it would be great if we joined forces. Yeah? We've been fighting and we've been winning. But Admiral Benitez will always have more than we do. We kill one soldado okay. today. Tomorrow, they get replaced with three more. And when La Moral people die, there's no one replacing them? Nothing. On top of that, these farmers and the people just trying to survive don't want to fight. Where are you going? So, yeah, nothing. On top of that, these farmers and the people just trying to survive don't want to fight. We need fresh blood. Real fighters. What about getting the legends to join? We tried. None of those abuelos want to fight. 
I heard a lot of them even support Castillo. You heard wrong. Well, I don't see any abuelos fighting now. I'm working on it. So, how do these farmers get a helicopter? They built it from the parts of where we shot down. Pinga. These farmers are 100% on our side. The other farmers are not? Some are. Some are with Castillo. You think we can get them on our side? We're gonna need them. Only what's going on? Have not seen Oron in a while. She better be okay. Venga acá. Yelena called. Do you want to lift to that boat? Let's do this. Get in. I'll get you as close as I can. Where did you learn how to fly? I did my basic service as a pilot a couple of years ago. I got kicked out for calling the captain a come mierda. <laughs> I was kicked out of the ground forces. Turns out drill sergeants don't like getting punched in the throat. Good to know. I never seen you before. When did you join La Moral? <laughs> Wait. I was told you were with La Moral. I'm doing this rescue as a favor. I'm with Libertad. What can you tell me about La Moral? You know that village? They call it Maldito. Is that the real name? Yeah. Some Spaniard named it back in 1490, whatever. Couple months ago, Admiral Benitez decided to make it illegal to go to the water and fish. The people protested. Benitez executed half the town. So what does La Moral do? They track and kill every last soldado who did the executing. And I'm not talking about guerrilla ambush jungle shit. I'm talking about following them to their homes and slitting their throats while their families are asleep. Assassin shit. These kids are smart, coordinated, and cold-blooded. Sounds like it. Show pass. We keep tabs on military convoys passing through them and report them to La Moral. Seems like they run a tight operation. These kids are on the ball. Yelena is more organized than the military. La Moral's got our back. When Admiral Benitez started getting rough with our families, La Moral got rough back. Killed any soldado who dared to step foot on our lands. Pretty soon, they stopped coming. Ship. I can't get you any closer. This is great. Gracias, mi amigo. Good luck saving those people.
On the ship. I freed as many as I could. Hang tight. I am sending boats and backup. Gracias. This is Admiral Benitez. To the fake Yaran terroristas, I have you right where I want you. At this very minute, military forces are heading to your position. I recommend laying down your weapons and taking one last look at a nation that does not want 